What's up guys, my name is McLando. I'm the coach for the Pittsburgh Knights Rocket League team. I'm going to be breaking down four RLCS plays for you. Our first clip of the day comes from Alpine Esports. This was game number two in our series of RLCS Stage 2 and Regional 2. Lots of twos there, but eh, anyway. This was our first real drive of the game. It really established our presence. The zombie comes in here to get a 50. His main objective, though, is not to take control of the ball, but to force awkwardness. It gives enough time for Kensei to come in here. But watch that background. Do you notice something? Zombie has swept the second man away. He bowled him over. That's right, he's gone. So that means Magic Bear is no longer the second man. Percy is now the second man and he is rotating past back post. This gives Kensei a lot of space if he wins the 50, and he does. Kensei takes possession, takes his time, and with just the slightest touch gets it over Percy. And with enough control, Kensei is able to get yet another 50. In an awkward spot with people barreling back. Now Magic Bear is relying on this touch to fall from the ceiling so that he can get it again. But Rodoko has seen it. Closing in on this play immediately, he forces a big hit. He notices something in the background though. Jordan is guarding the backboard. So if this ball falls anywhere behind him, he's got full possession. Jordan not anticipating the second touch Rodoko has here. All he has to do is get it middle underneath the crossbar. Since he's able to do such, Jordan gets a bad touch, and Zombie sees it all the way through. Relying confidently on his shot, we secure the first goal of the game. Our second clip of the day is against Envy. This was game four. Now Envy was right after Alpine. I swear, I did not just pick them because they're in order. Um, anyway, this is actually a play that was pretty clutch because it was a tying goal that seems simple but has a fair bit of thought put into it. Kensei gets a big challenge that forces the ball high up into the air. This forces the back post man here, Turbo, to assume the worst. Rodoko is up quick for this. If he shoots it on front post quickly, he has a better angle than Miss because Miss is in an awkward spot. Acing the ball backwards is not ideal. This forces Turbo to cheat up. Rad notices this about halfway through and adjusts his angle. Instead of shooting the ball, he's going to pass it. If you notice, Kensei is ready for this. Kensei takes his time, gets the right angle, reads it off the backboard, and bam, he's got himself an easy goal here. Alright, this third clip is one of my favorites, and you cannot call me lazy. This is back from regional number one. This was our game to get into playoffs for top eight, so there was a lot on the line. Kensei plays this really smart. He goes up for the challenge, but knows that Zombie is behind him. So he flips onto the wall. To have this height advantage means that if Zombie hits this high, which he does... But there's a play in the works here. With no one to cut it off, Kensei sees an opportunity. And I remember being in the call for this. They all called this happening. Zombie wanted the pass down. Kensei throwing it down. And Zombie there with the ultimate trust. And this put us well ahead for game number four to put us in playoffs. And our final clip of the day comes against Team Meteor. Now you're probably asking yourself, well, what happens in this one? Well, let me tell you. With those seconds dwindling down at the top there, you could probably guess what's going to happen. With the clock hitting zero, but the ball not hitting the ground, Hockey chooses to keep this up. With the ball in their half, there's a lot of potential here, as long as somebody gets a clean beat. And the clean beat is established by Kinsei. Hitting this off the backboard, there is potential here. And then the onslaught of offense continues. As long as the ball is hit up, there's nothing to worry about. So every touch is calculated to hit the ball just up and higher until one hit is down. And that is this one right here. With Zombie slamming this one down with enough force, he secures the game and the series. Well, those are some of my favorite plays of RLCS so far. Make sure to up your game by supporting the Knights, and I'll catch you next time for more RLCS action.